The Minimata Convention on Mercury is a multilateral environmental agreement that addresses specific human activities which are contributing to widespread mercury pollution. Ghana signed and ratified the Minimata Convention on Mercury in October 2013 and September 2014, respectively. A 10-year phased national implementation plan was proposed in December 2017 to support the sound management of mercury from all major sources in Guyana. Within the plan, the goal of a phase reduction in the use of mercury in artisanal, small and medium-scale gold mines to 75% of baseline consumption by 2027 was projected. Darcy Waldron, head of the Environmental Department of the Ghana Geology and Mines Commission, during a sideline interview at the Conference on Gold Mining, spoke to the work being done on the ground to achieve the targets. This has been done through um, a lot of our, of our projects where we do demonstrations of mercury-free technologies um, through the Mineral Processing Unit of the Ghana Geology and Mines Commission. We've, done, we've set up... Um, infrastructure where we even monitor the importation of mercury. The tracking of mercury upon entry into the country, research projects and educational awareness about the dangers of mercury are also in the action plan. With regards to the difference between the quantity of mercury that was being imported then compared to now, Waldron said there was no cap on the amount of mercury one could import. He added that in the last two years, the importation of mercury has declined. Now we have a cap as to how much mercury can come in within a particular period, within a particular year, and how much a miner or an importer can bring in. And once you meet those limits, what we try to do also, we monitor to see where it is, to see if it's been reduced, and if it's not, then you can't bring in any more. For the importations, it's reduced within the last two years. As it relates to specific human activities contributing to widespread mercury pollution in Guyana, Waldron said burning is one of such activities seen by the GGMC. This is why we've been encouraging miners to use retards, and even with the gold shops and stuff like that, mercury capture systems, where we can capture the mercury when you're doing the burning at the gold shops and stuff like that. Um, so that is definitely one area we've noticed and we've been doing extensive work. Whilst there is no penalties for miners who breach the utilization of mercury, Waldron reminded that importers found trading mercury illegally can be restricted for further importation of the liquid metal. Renata Burnett, reporting for the HGP, Nightly News.